Hey guys, so for watching this, um, Vlogmas Day 5 is like skipping. I believe Vlogmas Day 6, but Vlogmas Day 5 would not upload. So I decided to split it into two vlogs because it's taking forever to upload. And one will be Vlogmas Day, um, 7. And one will be Vlogmas Day 8. I think. I'm not sure, completely sure. But since my life isn't interesting, like I've said a billion times, um, it's, I'm sorry, but the vlog just would not upload. And I actually vlogged a lot that night. It was only 15 minutes, but. We'll see. Um, I'll see what I decide to do. I'm not exactly sure. I was going to combine it with today's vlog, actually. Um, vlog is May 7. I might do that as well. I'm not sure. You guys will see whenever you watch the edited video. <laughs> but it would not let me edit it. It would just, like, hate me. It would just be, like, um, pro it would, like, be at, um, processing. And then I look back at it and it would be, like, uploaded 12%. I was like, what? What happened to it? Like, I don't know, so, and then my laptop, it died last night, so then I just stopped uploading all together, so I kind of quit for a minute. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 5. Currently, I just got finished cleaning the scuff marks off of my shoes. I was really sad because I just wore these shoes for the first time today and they already had scuff marks on it, so I looked at how to fix it. And no polish remover and petroleum jelly actually helped, and I had both of those. So, um, what I did, first I tried just petroleum jelly because I was scared the no polish remover was going to take off the coloring, but it didn't. One second, it's a weird color. Okay, but it didn't, and, um, um, because I did push a lemon gel and it wasn't working. It was taking forever. So then I put nut polish remover on and it went really fast. So what I did, um, I have a picture of my scuff marks before. They were on the inside because I guess my boots were hitting each other. But, um, if you look at it, there's no more scuff marks. And I put on petroleum jelly because that will protect it from any more. So I don't have to do this all the time. These boots are super cute. I'm going to put them in my closet. I went to the gym. I'm going to film a video. Tomorrow we have... Like, this fruit distribution, and we have to be at that school, like, at 8, I think, and stuff, so, I might vlog that, I'm not sure. Um, also, I'm, like, behind, so I'm vlogging on the same day that it uploads, which I don't like, so I want to fix that. Which, I just, that means I have to vlog a lot today, which I can't. <laughs> so, I just combed out my hair, and it's, like, so big. This is what happens when you, like, have, um, naturally curly hair and you brush it. I'm about to go in my bathroom. <laughs> I'm sure you guys better. So I can see what I'm filming. Oh lord. I'm gonna do like a video on how to like manage frizzy hair. So I'm probably gonna film it tomorrow. So I'm thinking that I'm gonna take some pictures on my phone. Because this camera isn't really the greatest. My thumbnail. I'm gonna try and have my hair all poofy. And I'm gonna straighten it later today. And it's gonna be sneaky straight and other pictures. So let's get started. By one, by far, this one's the best one right now. Um, and then there's also that one, uh, that one, and that one. So it's out of those ones. I don't really like this one because you can see my arm. This one, you can't see my arm. So I think I'm gonna use this one. I'm gonna take some more of my flash so I can like, decide. Tomorrow is fruit distrib distribution distribution day which is like whenever we we sold we had a fundraiser for band and we sold fruit and so now we have to sell it i'm twisting my tripod off my camera because it's so weird holding it how do you do this um, i'm going to help then t um later that day tomorrow at four o'clock we have rehearsal so in between those times i have to film but we have rehearsal for band until like six o'clock and then saturday is um my um the concert, we have, I mean Saturday, Sunday is a concert, and the concert starts at 4 o'clock, but we have to be there at 3. Also, this brand of heat protectant is so good from Tresemme. Um, this is Thermal Creations. Um, oh, I think there's only one kind of brand, but the Keratin Smooth is my um, conditioner I use. It's amazing. It makes your hair so soft, so I recommend that if you have, like, dry hair or something. But um, this is the coconut oil I'm using. I think all coconut oil is the same, so I'm going to put this in my hair. I forgot that I was vlogging me, um, about my hair, but I started, and I got the very first layer done. Um, my hair is actually growing so much, not straightening it this much often. I've already cut off relaxing my hair, if you guys are, um, not familiar with that. Basically, that is whenever you put perm in your hair. Perm, if you guys probably know what perm is, um, white people, not being racist at all, but white people generally think it makes your hair curly, but for black people, it's called a relaxer, and it's the same thing, it just makes your hair straight. So, um, most black people get it, um, but a lot of people have tried to stop that and start getting, um, 
having their hair natural, which basically means not getting relaxers anymore. I cut that off about two, three years ago, just because I was like, oh, I don't need it, and I just got lazy with doing them, and I honestly, like, they don't do anything to my hair. So, now I'm trying to cut off straightening my hair, which is kind of hard. It's been not as hard, because over the summer, my curl pattern developed, which means, like, my curls got all really pretty, because if you straighten your hair and have relaxers for a long time, your hair isn't automatically just going to curl up and be, like, all normal when you wet it. It's not like that. So, I've had to straighten my hair, and I've straightened this part, and it's really long. It's to my button right here. It's probably, yeah, it's to my bra strap, almost. It is. It's to my bra strap on my back of my back, which I'm so happy about. Um... And it's really healthy too. That's another thing. You want to have healthy hair. So I got my hair cut, um, I want to say September. And it was, I was like hating it. It was like to here. But it's grown like an inch, which I'm really excited about. So, yup. Um, I'm going to um, stop straining my hair now. I'm going to make a smoothie and then I'm going to make some cookies. Okay, so I'm about to make my smoothie. I'm going to make a blueberry. Well, what is this? Is this blackberry? I think these are blackberries. I'm going to make a, yeah. Blackberry, stra blackberry, blueberry, strawberry, and banana smoothie with limeade because you don't have orange juice. This is all like the only kind of juice we have. And I'm so sad because I can't put kale in it and I'm not really sad about that. But I'm sad that we spent money on this like thing of kale and it's like expired because we don't use kale for anything else but smoothies. And we needed it for this one recipe for soup. So like this is like practically full and we just have to waste it because it's expired and um, on November 16th, which is obviously not good anymore. So... I'm gonna make my smoothie. I will vlog it. And then my sister's on her way home. She'll be home soon. I mentioned, I've been loving JB's album right now. I'm in love with it. This is my favorite song, Life is Worth Living. And then No Pressure. And I'll show you. <laughs> it's just all kind of tied. <laughs> This is the best and fastest that's ever blended a smoothie. I am in shock. I am so happy with this. Like, I think our blender, something happened to it. It's a new blender, but it's working like, it's been working like really good recently. This is my first time using it, but my dad's girlfriend used it for some lemonade. if it's weird to be like scared but like our window right there on the door on the back door doesn't have like any like blinds and i'm always scared that someone's watching me because they can see me but i can't see them even if i turn off the lights and it's creepy can i say that i normally hate peppermint chocolate or like just mint chocolate anything i just don't like it they don't go together and i don't really like mint like with like except for like peppermints and stuff and candy canes so I judged these Ghirardelli chocolate square peppermint bark things, but I just tried one and they're freaking delicious. Like, what have I been doing not eating these? I was like, you know what? Let me try one. They're limited edition. If you guys haven't tried these, eat them. If you don't like mint chocolate, chocolate. <laughs> if you don't like peppermint chocolate, try it. It's still good. Um, it's really good actually. So, I just wanted to, you know, I tried that peppermint chocolate stuff. It's delicious. What, you're eating it? I just have one. Oh, you can't have any more. Shut up. You've had so many more. It's so nasty. It's good. I don't know why I judged it. No, not Smappity Chattity. Vlog. Vloggity Vloggity. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, I said I was going to snap chatty, snap chatty, snap chatty, snap and then I realized now I'm vlogging. So, my sister and I have decided that we wanted to make a cookie cake, which Chelsea wanted to make one. I was like, oh, sure, that's fine. So, we're going to make a cookie cake and... I'm going to put it in this pan, and then Chelsea won't let me ice the whole thing. So I'm going to just make little decorations on my own little piece of cake. Here are our cookie cakes. This is the full one, and then we have a half one over here. Um, we just got, like, Pillsbury regular cookie dough. It's a little roll thing. And we just put it, we, like, chopped, we, like, kind of broke it up with our hands, and then we smacked, we, like, patted it in here. So now these are going into the oven. To cook at 350 for 14 to 15 minutes. That's a little too far in, Ashley. Okay. And then we have this blue frosting. Um, I'm not gonna. Well, I should prepare it because it's gonna be hard. But 
We have blue frosting that we got for cupcakes a while back. We still have cupcakes, Chelsea. I'm not going to eat any of them, honestly. I don't like cupcakes like that. I'm bringing the bag and see who wants something. Okay, so I'm gonna put it in a bag. These are what the sprinkles that you feel on. I thought they were up above the microwave, but they actually weren't. So we got green. Oh, we got Christmas colors. Awesome. We got green, red, and then we got like blue and green. Yeah, so take this up my dad's mom. You didn't look in there. In the oven. Never mind. Um, <laughs> I made her reenact that. She came in here and she's like, oh, yes, it looks so good. And then she's like, I think I'm going to listen to my vibe tomorrow. I made up a song. It's called No Sense by Justin Bieber. I mean, I made up a song. I made up a sprinkle version of this song. I was going to be like, uh, you didn't make that up. Justin Bieber made <laughs> So let's get it. This is it don't make no sense unless we're doing it with you. This is your setup right now. <laughs> it don't make no sense unless we're doing it with you. Yeah. I think I've done it all. Look at this. Chelsea! You snatch out of me! Hey, follow me on Instagram at SF Nicole. I'm making a little sprinkle song to Justin Bieber. I just finished straightening my hair. And I did a cute little hairstyle. One second, I'm trying to fix my chair. Okay, so I did little cute little fish towels. I'm not sure if they look bad or good. Um, my hair is falling out of them because my hair is super short and I wish my hair was longer. So that you could tell they're actually fish tails. But I'm going to think about them down below. I can't see them because it's on the side of my head. But yeah, I'm going to take them out so my hair don't... <gasps> Ooh, I'm about to take them out so my hair doesn't get them print. But yee! So I didn't get the decorated cookie. So I'm going to do it real quick now and eat it. Look how thick this is. This is like an inch thick. <laughs> I was expecting more, and I know you were probably expecting more, but this is my cookie. Now, I'm about to clean up all this mess. <laughs> There's so many dishes in the sink. <laughs> I hate cleaning the dishes. So, I believe that's all going to be it for today's Vlogmas. I want to get back on track. I'm sorry about my hair. I had to wrap it, but don't ignore that. But, uh... I'm trying to get back on track where you vlogged the day before, and so I tried to vlog as much as I could tonight. If anything else happens, I'll just put this at the end of the vlog. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Check out my last vlog miss. Actually, the playlist is linked down below. And I think that's it. See you guys next time. Mwah. So I'm really annoyed right now because um, I was uploading my video for Vlogmas Day 5. It was supposed to upload yesterday, but it, like, YouTube is doing something. It's not letting me upload because it was just at 100% and it was processing and then it went back to 12%. It's really annoying, but this is why yesterday's vlog was uploaded the same day that this one is uploaded, hopefully. Or no, the same day that... That's why two vlogs were uploaded yesterday. Um, it's really annoying and I can't fix it, but um, I have to upload two vlogs right now. So we are about to go um, into Olive Garden for dinner because my sister and my dad's girlfriend's birthday are um, a day apart. So Chelsea's is on the seventh, hers is on the fifth. Actually, two days. No, hers is on the fifth. Your lives on the seventh. Yeah, one day. You said one day, one day apart. Yeah, it is one day apart. This girl doesn't know what she's talking about. She can't do math. Anyway, we have to go in Olive Garden. What's seven minus five? Two, Two, but there's one day in between. Where's my phone? Let's go. Should I bring my camera? Should I vlog? I'm not gonna vlog, but I'll Snapchat y'all. Please, just for a second out there, just hold my camera and I tell you. Thanks. Jean jacket, this dress from um what seal, and then my boots from Old Navy. <laughs> How Chelsea feels about um. Taking photos from my Instagram. Like, huh? I'm too full. Guys, because she took some of my own garden because I wanted to keep background. And there were good pictures, but like the Olive Garden sign was in the background and it was like, you know, when photos make like stuff like, I don't know how to say it, like the lights like that. That's what it looked like. So, sorry, but it's not a cute. It, it, it don't make no sense unless I'm doing it with you.